Hey guys, this is Danny. Um, I just got Ableton Note. Uh, I've only had it kind of for about 10 minutes. Um, but this isn't going to be about Note specifically. I'm going to just show you a workflow for getting Note Groovebox stuff into Koala. Um, so what I'm going to do is just quickly make up a beat. I don't know what, I just started a new thing and it's basically picks a a set of sounds for me, so I'm just going to see what it's got me. Okay, right, so I'm going to make a beat. Okay, cool. Right, so now I'm going to just go to... Okay, so uh, what you can do with this is uh, I'll just I'll just drag this way. Right, let's go. Again. Two, three. Right, cool, so... Right, what I'm gonna do is try and uh, get this out into Koala, and I will do that by splitting things. So I don't want the whole thing, I don't want all the layers to be taken. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to move this to its own thing, which is annoyingly, there you go. Right, so uh, what I found is that when you export through this dialogue up on the top right, you export audio, it adds a bit of a gap at the end, um, which is a little bit annoying because uh, you don't, you can't auto chop. So what I'm going to do is just to quickly add a... So I just added a, a sound, right? And what I'm going to do is use that sound as a chopping point for when I export. So. If I export audio, wav is fine. Let's export bouncing. So at the end, you'll see that it it added a sound. It added a bit of space. So where it would end, it actually adds a space. So what I'm going to do is share and save to files because Koala doesn't show up along the top for some reason. Let's go there. And now I'll go to Koala. Uh, let's. I need to check the BPM actually. Let's go in here. And we've got 81, right. So I'll go Koala, sequence 81. And there we go. Now, if I import, set to import, import the file, set three. <coughs> All right, so now what I need to do to make my life easier is chop the file down to that last note because I don't want it so it's just really a placeholder for where to chop to and now I can crop um, and then if I auto chop then I can auto chop into segments so let's see I don't know how many so because that ended up quite cool actually. That loop is that loop is only one bar, which is why I've ended up with five chops. Now, if everything was equal amounts, then you could just um, set it to whatever you want. But anyway, this now I can get rid of that because that's a two bar. Um, well, it's actually yeah, it's a two bar, and this is a two bar. So let's make one shot. No choke group and chop. So now I can just go, and it should sound the same. 
so I actually just need to do this. Uh, and I probably need two bars. Make these two. Repeat that one. And there you go. That's how you get your chops out of no into Koala. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Obviously, I didn't play with the note stuff very much. And um, surprisingly enough, it came out better than I thought it would. So um, I'll see you around and have fun. Cheers.